This video presentation is going to provide you with the steps of logging into the CQL portal, managing your CQL portal account, and logging out of the CQL portal. In order to log into the CQL portal, you are required to enter your username as well as your password. Once I've entered my username and password, I'm going to select the login button. I have now successfully logged in to the CQL portal. Next, I'm going to go through the steps of managing my account. On the top right hand screen, you're going to select this person icon. And from the drop down, I'm going to select manage account. I'm now on the Manage Account screen. What I'm able to do here is a variety of different items. I can update my first name, middle initial, last name, as well as my email address. If I am to update any of these fields, it's important that I click the Save button to save my changes. Also, I can update my password as well as my security question for the event I were to forget my password. If I wanted to update my password, I'd select the Change Password button. It's now going to ask me to enter my current password. And now I have the option of creating a new password. So what I can do here is I can either generate a random password and then click Show Password, and that could be my new password or I can create my own new password. And in order to do that, I must follow the criteria above. The password must contain one letter, one number, one symbol, and be between six and 30 characters. As you can see, my new password has now met the criteria. Once I click save, it's going to tell me my password has been changed. Next, I'm going to show you how to update your security question. I'm going to select the change security question button. Once again, it's going to ask me for my current password. I'm going to utilize the new password that I just created. Now I'm going to come up with a security question. For this example, I'm going to use, what's your favorite food? And my answer is going to be pizza. Please note, <clears throat> But the security answer is case sensitive. Once I've updated my security question and answer, I'm going to click the save button. I have now successfully updated my security question. Next, I'm going to go through the steps of logging out of the CQL portal. I'm simply going to go back to this people icon at the top and select log out. And now I've successfully logged out of the CQL portal. This concludes this video on logging into the CQL portal, managing your CQL portal account, and logging out of the CQL portal.